Justin, I'll, I'll answer. It is one more question. Justin Joseph, why isn't Eucharistic prayer one used for church services even on solemn mass like Christmas, Easter, etc.? I haven't observed it at least in churches in the Archdiocese of Bombay. But live stream masses of US, Canada, UK is often used. Yes, I, I thank you, Justin. I agree with you that we must use Eucharistic prayer one often. Uh, I do use it, I'll just say, Archad, but I do use it for Christmas, Easter, uh, ordination, generally also Christmas. I, I think the major feasts, I do use it here at the cathedral. Uh, I, I suppose you're, uh, I, 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 wherever you are, uh, but here we have it, some, so some places they have, and I think the seminary also, I think, sometimes uses it. Uh, the difficulty, honestly, very honestly, I remember uh, a couple of years ago at Easter, I, uh, I, I suddenly had to change, I asked my secretary to change the missile, I marked, uh, because uh, something took longer than expected, the sprinkling of water or something, and by the time, uh, I was afraid, in the, it's an evening mass, and there's a curfew, you can't have uh, masses and loudspeakers after 10 o'clock. So I had to finish the mass by 10. And then I realized that something had taken longer and then we switched it from the first canon to the third canon uh, to say about four or five minutes. But, uh, but otherwise, uh, no, I, I agree with you. I think we must use it more often. I agree, it's rich. But keep in mind, the second canon is uh, very historical. From the second century onwards, it's being used. So they are praying exactly as they were praying 1,800 years ago. The Roman canon, the first one is little later, but also that. I think now 